Hi, my name is Franca and I'm a lawyer and presenter with EEO Specialists. I would be a very wealthy person if I received a dollar for every time I heard someone say that they didn't want to go down the performance management pathway with one of their staff for fear of a potential bullying or an unfair dismissal claim. Here's the first thing I have to say about this. You may not be able to stop the claim occurring, but you do have a lot of power over whether it would be proven. The best protection you can have for both of these is to follow your process, consult with HR or your boss along the way and keep really good notes about everything that you have done so that if a claim is made, you can feel confident that you have done the right thing, that you have the backing of your organisation and you have the evidence to support the processes you have followed. Please also remember that if a person discloses a disability or you have reason to believe they may have a disability, then you need to pause the performance management process, get HR involved in order for an assessment to be made with respect to what reasonable adjustments your organisation can or must do to support the person to be able to do their job. Um, I've attached for you, or you can request from Claire, a flow chart that outlines the process to be followed. I hope these videos have been useful to you in reminding you of some of the relevant considerations when performance managing your staff. Remember to check out our website or contact Claire at equalopportunitytraining.com.au if you'd like any more information.